Hello everyone, back again with another solution. So few days ago, I was trying to build my app. I was working on this old project where I got this issues. So you can see this error. And uh, basically this error with uh, some um, some J Center or Bintray, Bintray J Center services and i'm not um, this my app is not able to receive any data or any communication it's not getting any communication from the servers we are getting 502 error from the server that is a bad cat gateway so basically i found this that this error is coming to so many peoples and so many peoples are writing about it on the page when they stack overflow so I decided to make this video. So you can see here, uh, basically the error which I'm getting is related to the J Center, which has uh, which whose services had been shut down. Now let me show you that. If you go to their official website, you can see there you can see if you can read this page is currently inactive and can only be viewed by team members so we don't know when this will come up uh, and if we are also not sure if it will come up because they have already announced that if you will read this test ferry blog so you will find that j center uh, j center and bintray is shutting now and what you can do that some of the solutions you can find there also but uh, in my case this doesn't work did not work actually and in some of the situations uh, some people have different solutions than others and some might have been facing the same challenges so I'm going to guide you through some of the most important solution which might help you to get away with this error so first and foremost thing this is the required one you should remove the j center from the build or cradle file and change it with maven central because now you won't be able to get any data from j center since it is shutting down okay now you can see here uh, how you can change it let me guide you through that let's go to the our android studio and i have already opened this file this is build.gradle file and you can see here i have replaced the j center with the maven center both from the repository repository and all projects here also i have replaced it with maven center but this also did not resolve my issues because the main problem which I was getting from this particular if I'll try to build right now it will again show me the show me show me the error the same error I'll get once again so now let's rebuild it and you can see the same error I'm getting once again basically the issue was i was getting from this location this location of uh, package and if i remove this location package and if i'll do pub dot cat let me show you then uh, it is loaded now now let me rebuild again so what i did how i came up with the solution i came to know that uh, this particular package was dep dependent on this i was requesting for the data from the j center and it was uh, due to this i was getting error 502 so i replaced the location plugin with the geolocator so geolocator is completely similar to the location packages so i replaced it with the j center uh, geolocator sorry now you can see i'm able to my build my app now so you can see here in my case 
this is how I came up with the solutions. Okay, some other errors are coming, but still my app is building. Now, it will go through the GitHub page. You can see, you will find from this link. You can, you can see here, this is the error. And so many comments are there. 66 comment. And this issue was resolved, resolved 16 days ago only. It was raised 16 days ago only. And different people have different solutions uh, but the only solution which I came across in my case was to remove the location packages but in my case my project setup was quite old and it was not nursive if you have if you want to continue with location plugin only you can simply migrate your project if your project is older you can migrate to the null safety and if you migrate to, to the null safety or updated flutter version so you won't be able to you won't be uh, you won't get this error actually and in some of the cases people uh, also had this particular issue with the pyrvis message with the old version of the Firebase messaging. So if you are using Firebase messaging, you can simply migrate to the latest version from 9.1.4 to 11.1.0. Or else, so here are some of the solution you can see here. This is also solutions. And some other people came up with the solution. I have also written over this. I tried to help people on the GitHub also. Even I raise a uh, issue on the stake overflow so you will see i've shared the stake overflow link here which i raised so this was and some people also came with the solution by uh, changing the this particular android gradle wrapper gradle wrapper dot properties file from this particular to this particular file uh, this particular version to this but uh, going to the next version to 6.6.1 so you can also upgrade your gradle version so i hope this is this will be helpful to you this is how you can resolve your solution uh, you can get uh, away with this problem and i'll also share all these links related links in the description so thank you